Among vitamins, vitamin D and vitamin B12 are the two ignored vitamins which are crucial in our health. Today, I am going to discuss about their symptoms, deficiencies and sources to improve them. Hi, this is Pavni and welcome to Health Ethics. First, vitamin D is completely different than most other vitamins. Despite its name, vitamin D is not a vitamin but a hormone or pro-hormone. Vitamin D is both a nutrient we eat and a hormone our bodies make. Many diseases are linked with vitamin D deficiency. In fact, it's a steroid hormone produced from cholesterol when your skin is exposed to the sun. For this reason, vitamin D is often referred to as sunshine vitamin. This vitamin is essential in maintaining a healthy bones and teeth. It also plays a many other important roles in the body, including regulating inflammation, immune function, your digestive problems, sleep disturbances, and also some other heart issues. This vitamin D deficiencies depends on many factors like you know age, geographical location, your season, the time of the day, the skin color and sunscreen you use can also affect this production. You know what? People with the dark skin have high amounts of melanin pigment in the outer layer of the skin, which reduces the ability to produce vitamin D from sunlight. Also, people with obesity, high levels of fat in the body also limit the ability to absorb vitamin D from the skin. People who might need extra vitamin D include like older adults, breastfeed infants, and also people with dark skin. If you see, these days, the main cause for vitamin D deficiency is our lifestyles. Everyone spend most of the time in indoors or offices, even go to office in bus or cars. Being in India, we are lucky as we stay close to equator and we have sun throughout the year compared to other countries. Let's see some symptoms of this vitamin D deficiency, like weakness, tiredness, back pain, pain in your legs and hands. But these symptoms are non-specific. Check serum vitamin D levels. In some cases, getting enough vitamin D from sunlight and diet alone may be challenging. Then the option would be supplements. If vitamin D levels are below 20 nanograms, you should take supplements once in a week and continue for 4 to 8 weeks. Even if you take more vitamin D, hypervitaminosis happens. So take supplements with your doctor's advice. At least spend two days in a week in sun. We get most of the UV rays between 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. in which vitamin D is prepared. But remember, wearing full sleeves and pants and going in the sun is of no use. Wear short sleeves and shorts. Only 60% of vitamin D is absorbed in the body. There are other benefits with sun exposure like serotonin is released, which is again good for your mental health skin diseases and also good for your good sleep. It also helps for the good hormones release. One of the most important thing is do not apply sunscreen while you go in the sun. Let's see some sources of vitamin D in foods. Few foods are naturally rich in vitamin D3. The best sources are fatty fish like salmon, tuna and some fish liver oils also work. Smaller amounts are also found in egg yolks, cheese, some soya products and liver. Certain mushrooms contain some amounts of vitamin D. In addition, some commercially sold mushrooms contain higher amounts of vitamin D due to intentionally being exposed to higher amounts of ultraviolet rays. On the other hand, many foods and supplements are fortified with vitamin D like dairy products and cereals. You know what? Many of the women are prone to osteoporosis. Firstly, women have a smaller and thinner bones compared to men. Secondly, estrogen, a hormone in women that protects bones, decreases when the women reach menopause stage. With aging, estrogen reduces and so does bone density also. Thirdly, the family history of osteoporosis or the low bone mineral density also put one at a greater risk. Exposure to sunlight is the best natural source of vitamin D. However, Sunblock and sunscreens reduce the amount of vitamin D in the body despite staying in outdoors. At least 10 to 15 minutes in the morning sun rays is advised for healthy benefits. 
Apart from sunlight, vitamin-rich foods and supplements are suggested for vitamin intake. Whatever we do, nothing can replace sun rays. So, get exposed to sunlight every day. The next most ignored vitamin is vitamin B12. Vitamin B12 plays an essential role in red blood formation, cell metabolism and also nerve function and production of DNA. Signs and symptoms of B12 deficiency are feeling fatigue, weakness, tingling sensation and also less hemoglobin. This potential long-term consequences of untreated vitamin B12 deficiency can also lead to a nerve damage and anemia. However, people who follow a vegetarian or a vegan diet may be prone to deficiency of B12 because plant-based foods don't contain this B12 vitamin. Sources of vitamin B12 are fish like salmon, sardines, tuna, eggs, organ, meats and liver, kidney, yeast and milk products like curd and buttermilk, cheese, fermented foods, all these have vitamin B12. And this vitamin B12 is a key nutrient that your body needs for many essential functions. The bottom line is, without these two super vitamins, your health can take a steep decline leading to soft bones, nerve damage, tiredness, stiff joints and many more. So, get your daily dose of vitamin D and B12 to stay healthy. This vitamin D is nature's way of reminding us to get outside and play. When life gives you sunshine, make sure to absorb a daily dose of vitamin D. Thank you and take care. Yes.